What up, folks? Steve is here. We got another Masterverse figure to check out. This is also, yeah, uh, new or whatever. Uh, Masters of the Universe, new attorney of Merman. I'm excited to check out this figure. I like Merman. He's been a favorite of mine since childhood. And uh, yeah, let's explore a little bit of the packaging before we get into this figure. Uh, there's a big old octopus down there he could summon to help him in his battles or to help in his treachery. Here's uh, Manny Faces fixing to throw uh, Beast Man into the, into the water, into this lagoon. There's another uh, beastie right there. Pretty cool. There's Merman right there. I guess a sub he has already summoned the big giant octopus or squid or whatever. And uh, yeah, there's Merman too right there. Freaking awesome, man. Freaking really cool. Yeah, can't wait to check this guy out. He looks amazing. Contents list. He comes with two hands, a spear, his uh, sort of, uh, what is it? The sort of, oh man, not the sort of Koresh. Oof, I forget the sword's name, man, but yeah, oof, man, how, how dare I forget the sword's name, but yeah, uh, the comments, man, uh, leave leave a comment below if you remember the sword, sort of Rakash, Rakash, that's it, and there's Merman, we're back, I like this Merman so far, he's pretty cool, his sort of Rakash is uh, pretty gummy, pretty freaking gummy, but other than that, it's still cool, looks cool, man, it's real gummy, real gummy, that's freaking dope though, man. That's freaking dope. That is cool. It's like a scimitar with, uh, yeah, just made out of um, coral or whatever seafaring thing this was or whatever. Yeah, it's nuts. And here's uh, his spear, kind of the same. That is cool. A little bit of paint imperfections, man, going on with some of these. But yeah, other than that, cool piece, man. Freaking cool piece. Looks like there's a wash too right there. That's cool. This thing's kind of techy too, man. You can see some little, yeah, that's crazy. Little buttons and stuff. That's cool. Comes with extra hands. So there you go. They're all like metallic gold. Like a metallic greenish gold. That, that's pretty neat. Got two of those webbed hands. And we'll take a closer look at the merman himself. That's freaking awesome. That's rad. I wonder if his jaw moves. Can't tell if it does or doesn't. I don't think it does. His mouth's just open though. But I like they gave him translucent eyes. So that's freaking cool. You can see the white of his eyes. There's pupils. Oh, why did I start out of my eyes? <laughs> that's freaking rad. This dude's bad. Awesome. Freaking nice, dude. Nice scales on his panties. That's freaking cool. Very decorative. Even the belt. There's a seashell, because he sells seashells by the seashore. Uh, or either that or he steals them, I don't know. But uh, yeah, he's got some fins right there. Nice blending of the paint right there. That's freaking cool, man. Even his body, it's got like a nice like mother of pearl metallic blues and greens and all that. And there's a lot of nice colors all over this guy. That's freaking cool. His shin guards. That's freaking nice. Articulation, check it out, man. Nice waist, midriff, that's cool. Even some weird kind of cordage right there, some kind of pipe, piping right there, that's nuts. That's freaking cool, detail on the back. Let's see, waist twist, legs go out, just perfect splitsies. Um, got upper thigh, double knees really tight calf cut and a rocker pivot swivel on his feet so that's cool yeah rad man and holes for pegs at the bottom of his feet so that's cool man next thing we gotta do is just get this guy accessorized and all posed up man but yeah the details are yeah and it's spare any on this man that's that's freaking cool dude freaking nice I have merman all posed up ready for battle oh dang it he didn't want to stand all right gotta mess with him a little bit I mess with his feet a little bit because they are rounded on the bottom a little bit. But uh, other than that, yeah, I'm going to stand. Anyways, there he is, man. He's rad, dude. I like this figure a lot. If you're a Merman fan, this guy's tops. This guy's tops in my book, man. Man, it's freaking cool, dude. He's rad, man. He's rad. A lot of this seems... A, a, like The forearms seem new. The shin guards are... Like, I think the shin guards are new. All the accessories seem pretty new to me, too. And, um, yeah, maybe reuse of hands and reuse of feet. But other, because you got like skeletal feet and stuff like that. Um, other than that, yeah, he's badass, man. Really.
good looking figure. The details are amazing. Just, uh, yeah, really nice, really nice figure. Really nice, just everything. It's just badass, yeah, it's a really good figure, man. Really, they did a good job with this Merman, man. That's just, they did a good job with this Merman, man, man, man. But yeah, anyways, uh, once again, thanks for watching all. And I guess we'll put all the figures together that I picked up today just to look at them, you know. The latest pickups, yeah, good old Sorceress Tila, or AKA Green Goddess Tila, New Eternia Merman, and a New Eternia Battle Armor Skeletor. Freaking great figures, I like them a lot, man. They're great, great, great stuff, man, because yeah. It's awesome, man. Awesome stuff. Anyways, once again, thanks for watching, y'all. And, uh, yeah, I'm sorry I didn't get the Man of, the man of War Mad at Arms yet. I don't know. I'm just kind of holding off on that one. I do want to get him, but, yeah, I just don't have to do. Anyways, once again, uh, thanks for watching, y'all. Have a good one. All right, later.